Look, y'all, man, this is getting weird. If I was Dillian White, I'm t I'm going to tell the WBC to abide by their words and give me my motherfucking belt. And and enough of of uh, listening to people and trusting people and trust and trying to trust the process because I'm pretty sure that's what their people somebody is telling you because that's what your career looked like. You know, go and take that WBC belt, man. The WBC said. Your motherfuckers got 30 days to uh, to negotiate or to come up with a uh, uh, a contract, an, an agreement, you know. And it didn't happen. Get your fucking belt. If, if Tyson Fury's team ain't talked to you yet, get your fucking motherfucking belt. Stop playing with these dudes, man. Stop playing with them. God forbid Tyson Fury fucking gets hurt. God forbid Tyson Fury uh, gets back on the booger sugar, retires or whatever the case may be, you, then you don't get that belt. Then you don't get it. You don't, you, you don't get it. Hell, they might fucking call somebody else to, to fight for that fucking belt. They can. Time for you to take your shit in your own hands, bro. Don't let these motherfuckers, uh, you know, um, swindle you. I'm on, but all this stuff is according to Michael Benson. So, you know, people be getting shit wrong, man. So, you know, all the shit is, you know, it is what it is. Just a thought, you know, just a thought for me, man. From one dude to you. That's all it is, man. I'm just saying, you know, Dillian White, you know, you trust the process long. For a long time, ain't worked out. At least if you got the WBC belt, at least you got something that people want. Extra. You know what I'm saying? Now, people, and a lot of these guys, you can whoop. You know what I'm saying? Now you will have something. Now, no matter where's anybody else say, Dillian White was technically a champion. You just got to defend that bad boy one time and you can. It's, it's your right. He forfeited. You ain't got to fight him. You can fight whoever the fuck you want to after that, bro. You can fight Tyson Fury. You can fight uh, Deontay Wilder, um, Joe Joyce. Um, and the list goes on and on. You can fight him. You can fight who the fuck you want to. But I'm just saying, you got to listen to me. You can, you can listen to whoever the fuck you want to, but I'm telling you, if if you don't if you don't keep if these if these boxers do not keep pressure on these sanctioned bodies, they gonna keep fucking people over. Look what um um oh um uh, oh Brian and um Fresno Quindle had to do with the WBA. Look what they got to deal with. You know what I'm saying? Look what all these other fighters. Got to deal with with these sanctioned bodies, screwing them left and right, franchise champions and all. You know, and not giving a fuck about this, this the the uh, the judges, letting them do what the fuck they want to do, whatever the fuck they interpretations of. I don't know, man. I'm just saying, take the motherfucking petition, man. That's what I'm doing. Fuck it. You already tried this. You already. Um, Handed WBC some paperwork so you can fucking get some evidence. You might as well go there. You might as well take two more motherfucking steps. Get get real knee deep in their ass. And, and get what's owed to you. Because if you don't, man, they, they 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 looking at you like you that dude. You that dude to fuck over. You that dude to fuck with. You got it on your forehead. And a lot of these fighters got on their forehead. Says dude to fuck with. Because they, they don't stand for nothing. They don't stand for nothing. They don't they don't they don't fight for, for, for what's theirs, their rights. None of that shit. They just lay down, get on the internet, run their mouth, and their promoters and their manager damn for show ain't helping. Cause they probably end on the con job too. But all I'm saying is at the end of the day. Sucks to be Tyson Fury. 
Now, on that note, shout-outs to the LDBC, and everybody stay stuck and free.